I recently shared a video about a new skin retouching technique and you guys really loved it. Many of you asked if I could make an action for it so you can retouch your skin in just a few seconds like this. So in this video, I will show you exactly how to create that action. Let's get started. I've got this picture ready to go. First, let's open the actions panel. If you can't see it, no worries. Just go to the windows menu and make sure actions is checked. Once it's open, click this icon to create a new set. Give it a name and hit OK. Next, click this icon to create a new action. Name it, set a function key or color if you want. And click record. Now everything you do here will be recorded. First, make two copies of the background layer by pressing Ctrl and Z twice. Hide the top layer for now. Right click on the first copy and convert it to a smart object. Go to the filter menu, noise and median. Set the value where the acne begins to blur and fade. For this picture, that's about 48 pixels. Now go to the layer menu, new then layer. Change the blending mode from normal to overlay. Make sure 50% gray is checked. Then click OK. Right click to the layer and convert it to a smart object so you can edit it later if needed. Go back to the filter menu, noise and add noise. Keep it around 4% and make sure uniform and monochromatic are checked. Now go to the filter menu, blur and Gaussian blur. Set the blur to 3 pixels. Unhide the top layer, right click and convert it to a smart object. Change the blending mode from normal to vivid light. Go to the filter menu, other and high pass. Gradually increase the value to bring back some natural skin texture. Select all three layers and create a group. Let's rename this group. Double click here to open blending options. In the underlying layer section, hold ALT and drag the left slider to the right to remove the effects in shadows. Do the same with the right slider to remove the effects in highlights. Now create a group mask. Press CTRL and I to invert the mask. Now go back to the actions panel and stop the recording. We will use these actions on another image later. For now, select the brush tool, set the flow to around 33% and make sure the foreground color is white. Now gently paint over any areas with acne or uneven skin and watch the magic happen as the skin smooths out in real time. Now let me show you how to apply an action. Go to the actions panel, select the action we created and simply click this play icon. And then all you have to do is simply paint over the skin with the white brush tool to see the result. And that's it. I hope you learned something new today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.